warahmatullahi wabarakatuh So we are from Dahasa We like to present about fizik From satu topik tema equilibrium So this is our group members First uh, Sharifah Fatah Nashra uh, Aini Fatiha Nur Fatiha Cik Wan Azimuddin And Muhammad Harid So Firstly, meaning of heat and temperature. Heat is a form of energy and temperature is a degree of hotness of a body. Next, comparison between heat and temperature. Temperature is a degree of hotness of a body while heat a form of energy. Temperature is base quantity and heat a derived quantity. Temperature is depends from the kinetic energy of the molecule, while heat depends upon temperature, mass, and type of material. The style you need for temperature is K or degree Celsius, and the SI you need for heat is Joule. Uh, temperature is measured by thermometer, and heat is measured by Joule meter. So next, the principle of thermal equilibrium. So as you can see, thermal equilibrium occur when two objects are in thermal contact. Heat flow from the hot object to the cool object. Both objects reach the same temperature, and suddenly that heat transfer between two bodies is zero. So, uh, the example of thermal equilibrium concept in the life, such as heating object and cooling object. So, this is the example for heating object is hot air is an oven is thermal contact with cake butter, and heat from hot air flows from flows to the cake butter. And it caused the cake butter to be heated and to bake. Opening object, some food is put in the refrigerator. Heat flow from food to air in the refrigerator. When thermal equilibrium is achieved, the net heat transfer is equal to zero. The temperature of food and A and A and A in the refrigerator is the same. Next is specific thermometric property. So, for mercury thermometer, thermometric property is volume of mercury varies with temperature. Resistant thermometer is electrical resistance of a wire varies with temperature. For thermocouple thermometer, is electromotive force varies with temperature. For gas, for gas thermometer, is gas pressure varies with temperature. Calibration of thermometer. Calibration of thermometer contains two. That's its upper fixed point, uh, 100 degree Celsius, and lower fixed point, 0 degree Celsius. Next is formula to calibrate thermometer. So as you can see, that's the formula. Uh, next, mercury thermometer. So mercury thermometer contain a capillary tube, a mercury, and thin wall glass bulb. So, the specific the specific thermometric property is the change of the volume of mercury with the temperature. So, as the conclusion, when the temperature increases, the volume of mercury also increases. So, how the sensitivity of the thermometer can be increased? First, we can reduce the diameter of the capillary tube. The second one is using a thinner wall glass bulb.
Uh, so why Mercury is used in the thermometer? Firstly, uh, Mercury does not stick to the glass. Mercury also has a higher boiling point, and it expands and contracts uniformly, and is opaque and therefore easier to read. So lastly, last but not least, uh, thank you for our mentor, Puan Sunanti Binti Kamari and our school as I'm sorry, Sultan Mahasmu for giving this opportunity. So, thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.